Hi, my name is Bob Gallagher. I'm the mayor of the city of Bettendorf, Iowa. Today is Friday, November 26, 2021. Happy Thanksgiving to all of you in our community, and we hope that you enjoyed a wonderful day yesterday with friends and family. We are today at City Hall talking with our city administrator, Decker Plain. Decker, thanks for joining the mayor's message. You're welcome, Your Honor. So we want to talk to Decker a little bit today about an award he received this year when he was inducted into the Iowa League of Cities Hall of Fame. We uh, had the opportunity to go to uh, Coralville, a bunch of us, to, to be there for the award. And we wanted to talk to you today about this award and what it might mean to you, especially in this holiday season. Well, obviously, it was very humbling to... Uh to receive the award and then to have the kind of uh, camaraderie that showed up, uh, you and former mayor, and former, former mayor Mike Freemeyer and lots of uh, current staff, department heads and former staff. Um, it was very humbling. Family was there. Uh, my family. Uh, so um, I'm, I'm grateful for the award. I've um, experienced uh, 31 years with uh, the Iowa League of Cities, and so I know a lot of people throughout the state. It's been wonderful to create those relationships, and um, I'm, I'm thankful for uh, in the relationships here. Uh, I've created lifelong relationships. Uh, my relationship with you that's already lifelong. <laughs> uh, uh, and and um, it's just a, a, a very humbling award, and I'm, I'm, uh, I, I'm at a loss for words uh, sometimes, which is not usual for me. So uh, thank you very much for acknowledging that. One of the things that I think sets you apart as a leader, especially here in our community, is the culture that you have created before my time here with the city at City Hall that permeates kind of throughout our community and all those who work here. The can-do, uh, public service, public servant, community servant attitude that we, I think, show not only in the departments that are housed here, but throughout the city and those who work in those departments. Talk a little bit about that can-do customer service culture that we have here at the city. Yeah, I think that's a, a, probably our hallmark is that we've tried to encourage everybody to think on their own, uh, be customer focused, um, uh, be a servant leader, uh, to be a true public servant and to get things done for people and don't put roadblocks or obstacles in their way. And it, it, it's permeated throughout the organization, and so we love uh, doing things for people. Uh, people sometimes expect us in government not to be able to perform, uh, and we, I revel in the fact that we try to get things done and make the place look clean, uh, 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 signals work, lights work, everything that happens in the city, um, it, it, it goes the way it's supposed to go. And uh, we should do that more, more often all the time and provide great great, great customer service for our people. I saw a t-shirt last night that Kevin Garnett was wearing in his Anything Possible video that says, do more, say less. And I love that because I think we should all do more and just say less and get it, just get it done. Agreed. Thank you for joining us. I know we here at the city are very thankful for the work that you've done in 44 years here at the city, 31 uh, or so as our city administrator. So we really appreciate that and uh, that can do customer service culture that permeates where we love to work. Thanks for joining us. As we rotate out today, we've got a lot of folks who are going to tell you what they're thankful for this Thanksgiving season. We're here with Brooke in Human Resources. Brooke, thanks for joining us. What are you thankful for this Thanksgiving? You know, Mayor Rob, last year we got a new dining room table. Very nice. And we hope to have all of our family and friends around it, but unfortunately last year we couldn't. So this year I am very grateful to have my family and friends around my new Thanksgiving table and for the time to be able to spend with them. Fantastic. Enjoy your Thanksgiving. Thanks. You too. Hi, we're here with Chris, our city attorney. Chris, what are you thankful for this Thanksgiving? Uh, thanks, Bob. You know, this, this year I'm really thankful for my oldest son coming home for college and bringing some friends and we'll oh, have terrific. a full, uh, a full table of young kids. So it's, uh, it's going to be good. Excellent. Have a great Thanksgiving season. Thank you. Hi, we're here with Amy from finance. Amy, what are you thankful for this Thanksgiving season? Uh, well, I'm thankful for music. Um, music is such a powerful uniter of people, um, both in good times and in bad. It just makes me really thankful that we have it. Fantastic. Have a great Thanksgiving. Thank you. You too. Hey, we're here with Taylor from Community Development. Taylor, thanks for joining us. What are you thankful for this Thanksgiving season? 
Well, thank you, Mayor. Um, I'm thankful for friends, friendly coworkers here at the city of Bettendorf. Okay. And uh, something right around the corner, a brand new bridge and a bike path that I'll be using this uh, after this holiday season. Yeah, December 1st, join us for the <laughs> ribbon cutting on the new bridge. Fantastic. Have a great Thanksgiving. You too, Mayor. Thank Thanks. you. We're with Brianna from Public Works. Brianna, tell us, what are you thankful for this Thanksgiving holiday? I, I am thankful for my family and especially my two boys. Fantastic. Have a great Thanksgiving. Thanks. You too. We're here with Denise from Communications, and Denise is the one who puts together these mayor's messages each and every week. So thank you for that, Denise. Tell the folks what you're thankful for this Thanksgiving season. I am so thankful that I get to do this. I get to spend every week with you. It's <laughs> super cool. I've learned so much, and I really, really am thankful for my job and the city of Bettendorf. Wow. Just going right to That's me in right. the city. That's right. That's right. I love it. You're not going anywhere. Don't worry. <laughs> You know, it's a great time to reflect. Yes. And like you, I'm thankful for the folks I get to work with at the city, the folks who support me and work at the law firm, uh, because those two jobs sometimes are very difficult to pull off without great staffs. And I'm very thankful for that. I'm very thankful that we're going to have an opportunity to gather with friends and family for this Thanksgiving holiday. And I can't wait to be back uh, spending time with our extended family and my children. So I'm very thankful for all of them to each of you. Enjoy your Thanksgiving. We hope yesterday was amazing and the rest of the weekend continues to allow you to reflect on some of the great things that we have in this community and in this world. And let's start a new positive attitude as we roll forward, remembering those things for which we are thankful. Happy Thanksgiving weekend.